hi guys welcome back to my channel it's lolo beauty and before we get started i just want to say everything in the video is alleged so i don't know how i missed this you guys probably already seen it but the clip going around of red and toya addressing the dj academics thing um they did an interview and the whole interview was fire excuse me first i just want to say that i love the vibe coming from the both of them i can definitely see how they were meant for each other i love how calm they are they are very calm but they straight to the point like it's like they they get they get whatever they need to say out but it's like a calm calm classy way even though you know they can get about their life you know i just love it and i love what she said when she was like listen I don't care if she upgraded or downgraded. As long as she's happy, it does not matter to me. My, she is not out here, you know, starting fights on the internet, you know, talking crazy out here. So why are you speaking on her in that in that way? And the fact that Toya knows that basically she said, like, I know people are going to talk about her relationship. I don't basically she don't care about that she just wanted to be in a respectful way and and what she was saying is true dj i mean dj academic age it looked it weird for you to be talking on these two young this young couple it just it was just all weird to even speak on them it was just really weird and i just love the fact that i'm gonna tell y'all my favorite part honey is when toy was like i'm going in that water about mines all the way in that water and meaning she going to worry about regina and then red was like listen she ain't going in the water i'm going in the water about mine like no like i love the fact that her man let her say whatever she was gonna say he was real calm in the back like he didn't say nothing. he just i'm gonna let my baby speak i'm gonna let her tell how she feel i'm gonna let her get her point across but when toy got done he they didn't even ask him what his thoughts was. He straight said, like, I told her, I don't want to be your, I, I'm not here to be your dad. But basically, he loved her. Like, they got their own bun. You could tell he loves Regine like a daughter. He literally said, I'm going to go to war about mine. She ain't going to war. Basically, I'm not letting my, this is my family. I'm the man of this house. So I'm going to go to war about mine. And like T.I. said, she under an umbrella. So don't mess with her. And I was just like, dang. Like, he said he just want his family to be happy. Do you know what I'm saying? He just want them to be happy. And if they're happy, he's good. But when they're not happy that's when he he basically steps in because he don't like to see them unhappy that is the man you're supposed to marry somebody that is suited and booted and and your 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 protector that to me that is a true protector how he spoke it was so positive it was so classy he didn't get ratchet he didn't get loud with it. it was very calm he let his wife say what she had to say but at the end of the day he said i ain't gonna let her get touched she ain't gonna she ain't gonna do that i'm gonna ride for them you know what I'm saying? And that to me, not just Toya, but for them, the family, speaking of all of them, I just love that. I mean, when I watched that interview, it made me understand why Regina is the way she is. She, her mom, very smart, very classy, edgy, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And her and Red really complement each other, really just epitome of just class to me and i love the fact when they was talking about their marriage and the man was asking like so what's the first thing y'all gonna do once y'all get married what's the first thing y'all gonna do and when they said listen if we get too drunk we're going to sleep because i feel like in your 30s in your early in your late 30s and going into your 40s even 40s you you know uh-uh it don't go like the movie we don't just go we don't get married and then we it, create magic in the room no if we get both get lit we passing out that's just how it go you know and i just love that i love how they just really keep it honest and genuine and real because i know people can relate to that because listen you know when you get a load of two three drink, drinks in you you laid out this, I mean, I don't know, but I just love the way they responded. And I just want to see, did y'all see that interview and what y'all think about the response that Toria and Red gave about DJ Academics? They kept it classy, didn't get crazy with it. It was very calm, cool, and collected, but they damn sure got the, they sure did get their point across. We ain't to be messed with. She is not to be messed with. So don't mess with us. I was here for it. And I want to just say, 
congratulations toya um and happy birthday i seen all the pictures on the internet of her birthday party um was it a masquerade ball and i feel like everybody was serving everybody was serving that is how you do it you you leave your wedding you leave cabo you celebrate you celebrate your birthday you got a honeymoon to go to when i tell you that is the that this is the man of celebration in toya and red's household they said they're going out with a bang they've been partying for what like two weeks straight i love it i love it no like three weeks straight because i feel like before that she had like the her bridal party remember is that when i think regina got stuck poked in the eye or something but i feel like they really been just living it up like I, mean, I love it. I'm here for all of that. All of that good, good juju. All those good vibes. I swear, good vibes on each and every one of you. But y'all let me know down in the comment section what y'all think. And wasn't that ball fire? Okay. They know how to throw a party. They know how to throw a party. And we all want to invite next time, okay? The aunties and the uncles and the nieces, they want an invitation. But y'all let me know down in the comment section what y'all think.